the Bible says, and God remembered Noah and every living thing and all the cattle that was with him in the ark. God made a wind to pass over the earth and the waters assuaged. The Lord has brought Noah through a terrible test, trial, tribulation, a literal flood upon the earth. And I'm wondering if during that darkness and that shakiness and all that fear and trembling, did Noah ever wonder, has God forgotten us? And when you're going through a trial, when you're going through the storm, when you're going through the flood that God allows into your life, you may wonder, has God forgotten me? It's very common. The psalmist would ask, would say, I am forgotten as a dead man out of mind. Psalm 30 verse 12. I will say unto God, my rock, why hast thou forgotten me? Why go I mourning because of the oppression of the enemy? Psalm 42, verse 9. Psalm 77, verse 9. The psalmist asks, Hath God forgotten to be gracious? It's very natural in the darkness to doubt the light, to wonder if God is still there, if the Lord really cares, if he will bring you through as he promised to bring Noah through the flood. But the Lord opens in this new beginning of chapter 8 the blessed reminder that God remembered Noah. And if the Lord is bringing you through a flood, and if the Lord has brought you through a storm, he has not forgotten you. God remembers you. He cannot forget his own. We are a part of his body, of his flesh, and of his bones. So when that darkness comes upon you and that fear enshrouds your heart and troubles your spirit, don't doubt in the darkness what God has shown you in the light, that God remembered Noah and God remembers you and will bring you through just as he promised.